Due to the explicit content, viewer discretion is advised. Watching for traffic, none, none seems to be there, so that's good. For oh, there's a truck there. You gotta be. Sh you couldn't see anything if you tried. Hello everyone and welcome back to Euro Truck Simulator 2. I know it has been basically forever since we have played this game uh, and I'm using the newest version uh, with a Freightliner Century that uh, myself and Bugs found uh, recently. In light of watching the uh, recent American Truck Simulator videos, it's kind of gotten me missing uh, just driving trucks, uh, uh, period. So I had to start a whole new uh, profile and get through that. Uh, so I got enough money to get a truck and get at least get loans to get a truck that I wanted, and this is, uh, replaces one of the Volvos in the game. Uh, I will do my best to get the link to this uh, truck and put it in the description, but all in all, it's a, it's a, it's a decent truck. I mean, let's look at the inside here, uh, and there it is. It's not too bad at all, not too shabby. Um, the only thing is the, uh, you know, the mirror placement's kind of weird, so when you see here, we don't really see them. Uh, we have to look left to look at that mirror, and right, you can barely see that one, so we'll just go ahead and turn on the fake mirror on the right. Um, and uh, let's start this thing up and head into town and pick a a load. There's supposed to be a job in this town here, a POS bed. It's right around the corner. So let's fire this baby up. All right. It's got a great sound set to it, I got to say. We're bobtailing, so I'm going to take off in fourth gear here nice and smooth. And I'm using my G27, of course. Um, wouldn't uh, leave home without it. And, uh, you know, using a six speed shift, eight shift pattern and hitting the buttons to go into the higher gears and all that. Um, really rusty in this game, but I think we'll be fine. Let's keep an eye on the traffic here. Make sure we don't get killed. Uh, it looks like it's clear. Okay. Awesome. We'll head over here to pos bed and see if we can get, pick up a job. See if we can pick up a job. All right. Pos bed right here. See if they have a trailer rate waiting for us. Ready to go. Ready to go. Mr. Subsia Postpad. All right, so we have two to choose from. We got the Euro Goodies one and the low bed semi trailers. We're going to do the sugar, 23 tons of it, to Innsbruck today. So let's take that job and let's head back there and pick up our trailer. Um, I think what I'll do is end up turning the reefers back on and all that stuff. Right now, the only mod I have in the game is this. Everything else is bone stock. Um, only the truck is the only thing I have modded. So there you have it. We're in eighth gear. Let's drop it back down into, let's go into fourth gear here. And there is our load we're going to pick up. So let's line it up and back on to her. There we go. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Throw in reverse. All right, I'm excited about uh, getting back into trucking again. Oh, getting closer. And uh, there we go. Put the right button. Well, now we've got it. Awesome. So we've got our trailer in our truck. Uh, Posped load here. And uh, we're going to take it where it needs to go. So it should be a lot of fun. Let's get started. Uh, we'll take off the second gear here. Not sure what the... Well, it was like 23 tons, but I don't have the realistic trailer weight mods on or anything so it's all default not sure what to expect from that okay looking good getting out of here so how was your guys's weekend it is monday happy monday to you mine was good um i did a live stream yesterday and it was um for lack of the word i mean i mean i had a lot of fun doing it but i i just got sick towards the end uh out of nowhere i just felt achy and feverish and all that but not severe i'm feeling way better today um and nicole was feeling the same way so i think we both had the same kind of whatever it was um and we took nyquil and conked out last night and that was that so nyquil is, is like the best thing ever the only thing i like to take i don't like taking very many um drugs but nyquil it is good stuff let me tell you so I, I woke up kind of groggy, but I, but I'm doing good now. I had to start this all over um, your truck because I didn't have a save game for it really. Um, I guess I was stupid and I didn't back up my old one. So from my old PC actually. Oh, we want to go back down to this guy. Uh, yeah, not tenth. Why in tenth? 
I hit the button. Oh yeah, there we go. Fourth. Um, third gear. Yeah, that'll do nicely. That'll do, pig. That'll do. We'll hold the brake down in neutral. Um, but yeah, woke up groggy, but feeling good now. Um, oh, I was talking about the save game thing. Yeah, I didn't really save that too well. So, had to start over. Not a big deal. It was kind of screwed up, I guess, before. So, it's nice to have a fresh start. So, that's why I'm so far behind in everything. But, nonetheless, we will do some trucking today. <laughs> and looks like we're going to have a toll. Toll booth Willie right out of the bat. Right off the bat there. Right off the bat. All right. Yeah, so like I said, you know, happy Monday. Hope your weekend was good. You can leave a comment below. Let me know what you did for your weekend. Um, we uh, we didn't do too a whole hell of a lot this weekend. It was a lot of just laying around and watching Netflix and whatnot, which I love to do. And I watched that uh, show. What is it? Big Rig Bounty Hunters. <laughs> Big Rig Bounty Hunters. And it that show is so stupid and fake and just i don't know what you call it um it's it's just uh it's oh staged just everything in it is staged and uh and it was funny because there's one part where this guy is uh he's talking about how they pick up this load for the military or whatever the guy wanted him watch out for that car um where that guy wanted us to be him to pick it up and there's this van following him, and I'm like, okay, this doesn't make sense. Well, they screwed up because the truck, they get off on an exit ramp, and uh, you get a shot from behind the truck as it's turning, and it's obviously from the front um, bumper of that van, which was the chase vehicle. And it's kind of funny because they uh, they make it seem like this they're you know being followed by this uh, van. And there's a shot of it on the highway, and you can see the GoPro camera attached to the bumper. So I was like, oh my God, you're not being followed. It's just, it's really bad acting too. I don't know, if, if you've seen it before, you know what I'm talking about. And leave a like, a, a comment below if uh, if you have seen it, what you thought of it. Because it's, I think it's kind of stupid, but that's just me. We have big news. We're going to be moving on uh, 15th of February. And we're going to be moving back to my old house where I started YouTube, actually, up in St. Louis near the St. Anne. It's in Woodson Terrace. Um, and we're going to move in with uh, my mother. She needs help up there. Uh, but we're not moving in just for that reason. We're moving in because we need more space. Uh, and if you've seen my 50K video, you know we don't have very much space here. Um, I've got a twin size bed, you know, and um, like Bug said, it's, it's like a child's bedroom. <laughs> But at the new play, or at my old house, but it'll be new to us uh, and, you know, new to me and, uh, and Nicole as well, because we've never really lived in with, with each other in, in, in a lot, in a much bigger space. So we're looking forward to that. Uh, but I'll have my own office and that will be nice. I won't have the office slash bedroom, which can, it sounds good on paper, but let me tell you, it's not really. Let's go into 11th gear. I've got a governor on the engine if you're wondering what that is. Um, but yeah, we're just we're moving back. And you know, I know it's uh, it's not as nice of a house as this, but it's bigger. Um, I, I think the house is really nice. I like it. I like the floor layout on it. It just needs a little bit of things here and there. Uh, and if some of you guys uh, follow me on Snapchat, if you don't, it's Jay Fabiano. Uh, you saw that I moved my car yesterday, my 77 old Tornado. I moved that uh, yesterday up, up there. And that's the reason why I moved it. I'm gonna get uh, historical plates on it. It needs a little bit of work. It took about an hour and a half to get her started, but she finally did start, turn over. I had to use starting fluid on it too. And uh, gotta love the old, um, the good old carbureted engines. And I was asphyxiated on that uh, truck up there. I wasn't even paying attention to this little brown shit box in front of us. There we go. I wonder what the uh, Jake brake sounds like in this. I have not tried it out yet. Let's try it. Oh, nice. Not bad at all. Not bad at all, I gotta say. Let's hear it from the outside view. Let's hear it. Not bad. 
I'm bad at all. I like it. Good job. Yeah, whoever did the uh, this truck and who did the sounds for it, I like it a lot. I really love the Century, and uh, in America Truck Simulator, you can bet your you can bet your butt I'm gonna be driving one of these because it's my favorite. It's my favorite. It's my favorite. I've been watching uh, a lot of Boogie 2988's videos. God, just watching his old stuff is so good. I, I never really had a lot of time. Like, I've always liked him, but I never really had a, um, time to watch him. I'm not a big fan of his Francis uh, thing, but, you know, it, if it's his gimmick, it's his thing. That's it's cool. I, I like his um, actual vlogs and him being himself and, and watching his old videos. God, those are just absolutely hilarious. Especially the, um, I drive a car with my hands and my feet. I just go through those old videos, bored one day and having a good time. And I know a lot of you guys probably wonder what uh, YouTube channels I, I watch. Uh, and you know, and I try, I watch everybody in Code Zero that I can, uh, when, whenever, I, whenever I can. I watch uh, Spears whenever I can. I don't get to watch all of his videos, but I can see some of them. He's been doing a Stranded Deep video over there, and it's been pretty interesting. I've been really enjoying that series. I don't know how well I would fare in that kind of game. Survival games and me are just not the bestest of friends. Now right, let's Jake break this bitch. All the way down. That is so cool. Oh, there it is. Guys already getting tired. <laughs> All right, we're getting close to the end anyway. Got to remember, we got to put gas in this truck, and we got to watch for our sleep. I'm so used to driving company trucks, didn't have to worry about that. And I had fatigue simulation turned off as well. So there you have it. Meh, meh. All right, let's get around these egg timers. Oh, shit. Come on. Old timers, I mean. Oh, let's call it egg timers. All right, let's get over. Oh, we got the nose uh, mirrors, too. It kind of helps. I'm just dropping it in 10th and try to get around this guy that way. Might work for us. We're about to find out. We're about to find out, I'll tell you what. Oh, I'm looking forward to this week. I really am. It's going to be uh, it's gonna be a good week, I have a feeling. I have a feeling. I have a feeling. Dun, 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 dun. Who's believing? Um. <sighs> Shut up. It was funny the first time my dad played this uh game and he really likes this game a lot um that started happening and it, oh he was so upset about it and then i told him you know you can turn that off in the options you don't have to have fatigue simulation i did because i had that problem i don't know if you guys have had any issues um with your truck lately if you have the um the jobs not working and they're disappearing uh, when you get there, you have not like you get a job in the freight market, but you go pick it up and it's not there. Yeah, one of those deals. That is, that is something that um, I guess it's a bug or whatever. But you have to either sleep or you can do a SOS, which is like you know hitting what is it F7 or something to bring up the uh, call for services, and they take you to a different town and then they bring you back. That is the one. So. If you're having that issue, that might save you. We're gonna sleep at, up here. Uh, there's a sleeping spot right up here by the uh, toll, toll booth Willie. We're gonna Jake break this bitch all the way in. Let's do it. Oh, ho, 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 I love it. <sighs> Shut up. We're gonna. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. Telepath. Telepath. Telepath, please. Yeah, we're gonna sleep up here. That's for damn sure. We're gonna sleep up here for sure, damn it. That gun went down into third gear. Ho <laughs> ho. Hey, our toll. And let's uh, let's go to sleep. Sometimes I have to hit F5 a couple times to get it really zoomed in, so I know where the sleeping is. But I think it's right here. I have a feeling. Maybe we could just pull off right here, hoping, hoping in a Brian. Let's see what they give us here. Any option to sleep? Yep. All righty, cool. So let's uh, pull the old uh, parking brake there and uh, we'll kill the engine. And let's go to sleep. 
All right, we got an achievement for it. So looks like we're going to be fl driving at night a little bit here. That'll be fun. Let's turn our lights on. Fire this puppy up. Release the parking brake. We have air brake simulation turned on as well. And uh, let's go ahead and put her in gear. Turn our headlights on. Oh, look at that. The gauge is lighting up. That's cool. Okay, F5 that sucker over. Watching for traffic. None none seems to be there, so that's good. For Oh, there's a truck there. You gotta be sh you couldn't see anything if you tried. You motherfucker. Well, never mind. First vehicle crash probably won't be our last. <laughs> won't be our last, I'm sure of that. Them sons of bitches. Well, they take your money. That's for sure, don't they? You bastards, let's get ninth. Let's get some speed up. First incursion, right off the bat. I just couldn't see anything there. And these mirrors, I mean, that's the only bad thing about this truck are the mirrors. And we were right under that spot where you couldn't even see the light lighting on that mirror, see? So, it was my fault. I should have looked out my window and behind me. That probably would have been better. I have a feeling. I have a feeling that's what it was. Oh, well. We're not going to be too discouraged about it. All right, we got to go down this hill. So let's Jake break down it. Oh, baby. God, that's a little scary down there. All right, we're doing better now. I don't even remember what the button was. I, didn't, I don't have a button assigned for bright lights. Ah, that's all right, we don't need them. We'll be, we'll be where we're going soon enough. Soon enough, 59 minutes out. Not real minutes, of course. But 59 minutes nonetheless. And we got a toll coming up. We got a toll coming up. Hit it, baby, hit it. I'm ready for some warmer weather. I know some of you guys just got recently pummeled by the nor'easter storm and, well, actually, the central storm that moved through as well. But man, talk about we've just been getting lucky as far as um, all that stuff goes. Now we're getting really, really lucky. There's fifth, fourth gear, all the way down to third. There we go. One thing I noticed, uh, I don't think I noticed it before, is that um, you can uh, you can turn on the trailer brakes. So I do have a trailer brake uh, button that's signed now. Okay, so keep an eye on the left here. Yeah, actually gonna do a physical look there. <laughs> Never know what you're going, what to trust there. Got to hit the button to jump in the next set of gears. There we go. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, we're not going to be the best getting back into this. I didn't think I would be either. At all. But I'm having fun. Hopefully you are, hopefully you are too. I don't know what that's. Oh, it says headlights on inside here. Like, okay. We'll just jake in the tunnels. They really hate when you do that in real life. Like, don't you be jaking in our tunnels. They don't like it when you jake it in the tunnel. Got it? Got it? <laughs> I got it. I see a vehicle back there, but I... God, you can't see anything in these mirrors. They're like... I don't know if they're tinted or what it is, but... We gotta make a left here, because we're going to Zurich. I think we're going to Zurich, right? If we F6 it. Oh, we're going to Innsbruck. Okay. Innsbruck it is. Um, F5. F3. Yeah, this is us. This is us for sure. Why did I move that? I don't see any cars coming. Let's be careful here, getting on the highway. There we go. seventh gear so you hit the button you flick the button then you fly over i know on a real truck you uh do the other ways but for some of you guys that uh don't or are new to this you have to realize you can't float gears in this game they did not design it to do that i know you can do it in real life but you can't do it so i'm sorry i wish you could but they just i have to use the clutch every single time i use the go through a gear uh, downshifting wise, same thing. So, you can't float gears at all in this game. Just to let you know. 
So I know that you normally can in real life, but they say no uh, to us in this. We're all getting closer to our destination, 17 minutes out. We're we'll getting off up here. Let's kind of keep it in 11th gear. I know I'm so used to doing that with the company trucks. I need to drive in 12th gear, but saved us some um, gas. Hit those brakes. I love that sound of the brakes. They did a great job of that. There's usually no cars around here at night, but you never know. There we go, baby. There's seventh. <laughs> I was like, where's seventh gear? There it is. After a while, you just don't even look anymore. You just kind of know where the gears are and slide it over. <clears throat> you can tell it's a little earlier in the morning for me because uh, my voice is kind of all over the place. Hasn't warmed up yet. How now, Bronco? How now, Bronco? How now, Bronco? Innsbruck's been discovered. Innsbruck. Hey. Ain't no lights down here. We like that. We like when we don't have lights. We don't like the traffic lights if we don't have to have them. Euro goodies. That's our drop off zone. Alrighty. We'll just kind of cruise through here. It's up here on the left. I'll just go and turn on the old hazards now. The old has happens now. Alrighty. Oh, this is a pretty simple drop-off zone, so this won't be bad. To skip the trailer parking. We don't want to do that. That's the fun part. Alright. Let's we'll pull in here like this. And over like this. That's the nice thing about having these Euro trailers. Is they're really easy to, to get in where you need to get them. Alright. Okay, and we want to go in reverse. Let that wheel come around on us. And let's drop this baby back here. The Euro goodies. I thought we were going to Posped, but we picked up from Posped and we're going to Euro goodies. So there you have it. Shows what I know. We're going to have to do a pull up for sure on this backup job. On this backing up job. Watch that right side of the trailer. Hopefully we don't hit something back there. Hope we don't hit nothing. We'll just have to pull up and re-establish this a little bit better here. I'm fine with it though. Go back around here. Let's go in second gear. We want to go left a little bit more. Yeah. We'll do the old pull up method. Works, works wonders. Let me tell you. Let me tell you, works wonders. All right, there we go. We'll have a better setup this time. Throw in reverse, and yeah, we're, we're we're pretty much lined up for success this time around. This time around, we, we got shik shik headed our way, and that's good. Let's go to our uh, parking lamps, our parking lights. Oh, a little bit more left. There we go, and we're there. Look at that, not too bad. We'll hit the uh, pull the old brake out. I didn't mean to kill the truck, but I did because I hadn't reversed. Son of a bitch. Like I said, you know, we're not the best, but we try to do our we try to do everything we can. Let's have a look see outside. There she is. Not too bad. Not too shabby at all. I like it. Uh-huh. I like it. There it is. Alrighty. Let's see what we got. Job completed. Excellent. Proficiency bonus. Long distance delivery bonus. Bonus for parking the trailer. Look at that. Oh, and we just up to level five. Yay. Yay. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this one. Uh, leave a like. Um, leave a comment below. Uh, I meant to say leave a like. I meant to say hit, hit the like button if you want to see more Euro Truck Simulator. I'm not sure how many of you want to see it on the channel again, but um, for those of you that do, hit the like button and I'll know. Uh, leave a comment below. Let me know how your weekend was and what you thought of the episode. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care.